Hi there, this is Larry. Coming to you with another Christ United Methodist Church video devotion. I'm here in a hospital chapel and uh, kind of makes me think. Sometimes we, we lose sight of the little picture instead of the big picture, the little picture. The world is full of all kinds of things. We see so much on the news. We have so many things going on in our lives. We see things going on in the lives of other people. And um, sometimes we just forget that the world is made up of people. The same God who put the worlds together and he threw the universe into space and set everything in motion, put the physical laws in order, the God who deals with nations also deals with individuals. Somewhere in the world right now, there's a young man going off into the service, leaving his home for the first time, maybe nervous, worried about what could happen. Somewhere there's a, an expectant mother concerned about the health of her unborn child. Somewhere in a war-torn war country, there's a, a small boy who's afraid to go to school today because of what might happen. Somewhere in the world, there's someone who doesn't have enough to eat. The world's made up of individuals. The nations are made up of people. Sometimes we lose, we lose that concept and as we struggle with the things that are gonna go on in our lives, the joys, the heartaches, the tribulations, sometimes we forget that God cares about each of us individually. We can't comprehend that really because the world's such a big place and we can't think of how in the world could you keep track of everything. But see, God is much greater than us. His ways, are not our ways, his thoughts are way above our thoughts. He knows, he sees. In Matthew 10, it says, are not two sparrows sold for a farthing? And one of them shall not fall to the ground without your father. But the very hairs of your head are all numbered. Fear ye not, therefore, ye are of more value than many sparrows. You, an individual, God knows about you. The very hairs of your head are numbered. God knows about each and every one of us. No matter what you're going through today, no matter how concerned you are about things that are going on in the world, things that are going on in your life, um, Things are going on in your church. Remember this, that God will protect his own. God will protect his church. That the same God who put those worlds in position all throughout the universe, who set the stars in the sky and knows the number of the hairs on your head, cares for you. He will protect his own. He will protect his church. He will protect his word. For the grass withers, the flowers fade, but the word of our Lord stands forever. And we've got to rely on that. And that reliance should give you hope today. Whatever you're going through, and maybe it's joyful things. Maybe you've gotten a new car. Maybe uh, you just got engaged. Maybe everything's going just well in your world, and that's terrific. But God's with us in the good times and the bad times, and we've got to remember that. So that if the good times stop and the bad times start, that doesn't change. God is still there. So take comfort in knowing that the same God who watches over every sparrow watches over you. Remember the words of the song. For his eye is on the sparrow, and I know he watches me. And that should give you comfort as you go through this day and through the coming week. God bless you, and we'll look forward to seeing you again real soon on the Christ and I Methodist Church video devotionals. Bye now.